you cold? Am I cold? I'm sweating. I'm sweating. It is right now four degree wind chill. Yes, a lot of you up north, I know. We're wussies down here in Kansas. This is cold. Four degree wind chill, it's sitting at 19 degrees. Four degree wind chill. North, northwest wind. This field today, the only options were one, to uh, get in the middle of the field and lay in socks. And it would have been brutal. It would have been cold. It would have been brutal. It's not bad with this tree row and got yeah, a couple heaters. It would be horrible. Uh, so we opted tall tree row north side. You guys know I always preach stay away from tall structure, but with it being this cold, they've been wanting to press up against these trees and kind of get out of the wind. So hopefully it works today. Um, if you guys haven't checked out that new duck's coat, check it out. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, Go-to coat, absolutely. Uh, water, not waterproof, water resistant. I have to get that right. And extremely warm. It's got the hand cuffs for your thumbs. Um, removable hood. Sweet. If you want to pick it up, duckswaterfowl.com. Use code BOB, Bob. Save you some money at checkout. But we're going to get tidied up here, get the side by side out, and uh, get to rolling. Right? Yeah, a little bit. By the way, we do have some available hunts in January and February. If you are interested in those hunts to come here with us at Sand Hill Flyway, Central Kansas, um, the best thing to do is honestly, if you want to book right away, go to the Sand Hill Instagram right here and DM me. It's either me or Beth, my wife, who will talk to you. We'll give you the available available dates and a number to call to book your hunt. Please, 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 serious inquires only. Other than that, let's get in here and hope that they like it. <laughs> well, what do you think? Well, Any thoughts? For sure. Any thoughts on the day, Aaron? Well, today's going to be the first cold day. It's a real feel, what, four? Yeah. Uh, and it's not going to change much. So hopefully... This is this, the cold. Yeah, this is the cold we need. Force them to move. Uh, I'm sure they'll probably be a little tight in the morning. But this is be the fourth day they've been here. And they finally gave us an opportunity to hunt where we are today, which you guys will see once the sun comes up. So. Yeah. Hunting the situations. Yep, hunting scenario and uh, the calling. Like I always say, calling against tall structure it echoes real bad. But if you have a good north wind like today, what's it at 18 right now? Yeah, it's, it's gonna blow that sound. It's out. gonna be it's loud gonna, up where they are. Yeah, too. it's gonna drown that sound out, carry the sound away from the trees. If there's no wind and you're against trees, real bad, real bad deal. Like an echoing wall. So situation should work out. We're all pumped because. Uh, as you all know, it's been warm. A lot of you guys have been asking, Bob, is there more birds coming? What's your theory? Do you think there's more birds coming? It, there, theoretically, there should be. There has to up, be. Because up north, they They're have, still killing them up there. Yeah, well, and they just got three days of this wind in negative temperatures as a regular temperature. So. And they're finally got snow all over the place yeah, up there. Yeah, everything's so, freezing up. I think we'll see a big, one huge push, and then that'll be the last push of the year. But, um, Kenyon, you got anything to add? No. That's, that's why I went to you, because I knew you'd say no. <laughs> She'd be fun. I knew you'd say no. <laughs> so, Drew, anything to add? Your mustache is Hot freezing. hands. Is it freezing? Hot hands? Hot hands. Uh, I put them in my shirt pocket while they're sitting at B place. Yeah, there's that. one ice <laughs> hanging. It's probably a booger. <laughs> <laughs> put these things, fun little pro tip for you when you're setting up decoys. Find an inside pocket, put your hand warmers in there. These things are like on fire. They about melted through my chest there. Or you buy the electric hand warmers like me and Diddy have, mm -hmm. and they are a lithium battery powered game changer. Amazon, that's all I gotta say. Go look up battery powered hand warmers on Amazon. What are they, 50 bucks for two? Yep. 50, dude, 50 go bucks. Buy them. They, are, they look like a little white egg. And, and some of them double as power banks too to charge your oh, phone. Oh, really? Yeah. They're game changers. Uh, I can't afford those. I just use hot hands. Can't I got we can't afford those, but I can go through a hundred packs of hot hands. <laughs> the first one I've used all year. So a nice sick of gear. They're from last year. <laughs> Shut up, Aaron. Hi there, buddy. You ready, buddy? It's cold, isn't it? You know, still ain't running a vest on old Frederick. The vest really restricts his hips, so he's ready to go. You know. Good boy. 
boy sit. Good. Fetch him up. Okay. You hold. Man, they are doing the same thing. They are cutting the right beside over. the decoy spread. <laughs> The wind is picking up big time. What do you got there? Tylenol. No headache today. You got a headache today? No. Party too late? No, I went to bed early. What time did you hit the sack? 8.30, 9 o'clock. 8.30? Okay. Me and Bus stayed up with all the clients till about 10.30. Um, it's always fun, especially the last night. Me and the family try to stay up and gab with everybody. and socialize as much as possible before they have to leave this is our clients uh, last day here and we got one more group before christmas and uh, then we get a good christmas break to be uh all of us to be with our families so all the guys will head home for three four five days whatever it is and we'll all regather and hit it hard right after the holidays i want to wish you guys happy happy holidays um it's uh in my family christmas is the number one holiday on our list. We can't wait for it every year. The kids love it, we love it. Uh, we had the tree up when you guys got back from Thanksgiving. Yep, looks nice in there. Yeah, it does. Real nice. Beth does a great do oh, job, yeah, doesn't she? Absolutely, she loves doing it though, I think. She yeah. likes to get the Christmas cheer going. If it wasn't for Beth, the lodge would smell like... Probably a locker room. A locker room slash dirty chonies slash uh, yeah, like a wrestling mat. I don't know. Uh, big shout out to my wife. She works her rear end off. The, one of the biggest compliments we've had all season is this is the most organized guide service I've ever been to. Uh, the way that Beth takes care of the clients and gives them all the information and scheduling them and answers all their questions. Make sure that they're completely ready to go. That's the number one thing that we always get. So big shout out to my wife, Beth. I love you. Fred, let's go, buddy. Get in here. Good, drop, drop, hit set right here. Set, good boy. What do we drop? Two specs? Yep. Okay. Here's the first one. Come on, Frederick. Drop, drop. Ooh, look at him. Oh, there's your mounter. There's your look. Well, his wings completely well, demolished. Okay. They can fix that. That's a good looking spec. <laughs> Woo, that's a good, that's a beauty right there, boys. Shoot the two! Nice. Spread. Good shot. Here. Good boy. Come on. Come on, Freddy. Good. Set. Drop. Here we go. Another lesser down, baby. Good boy. 
Come on guys, smash the thumbs up for Fred. Look how jacked up he is. That a guy. Sit. Good boy. Shoot him right there, guys. I wasn't gonna wait. Watch that one. Yep, got a sailor. Here we go. I'm not gonna wait, because if we wait, wait, we lose him. Fetch! Hold! Hold, here. Come on. Good, set, set. No calling, they're doing it, look at that. Look at that, sit. Shoot him. Yeah, but wow, that was amazing. That one again. Okay. <laughs> okay, Fred. <laughs> Shoot him. Yeah, buddy. Wow, that was Shoot amazing. that one again. <laughs> that was awesome. No calling, and they just give me some skin. Come on now. Dude, we, we heard a. All we heard was a gur, 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 like a gur, gur. and I was like, what's that? Hey, fetch it up! Fetch it up! Let's go! Yeah, those there's are some, boys. there's some big boys there. There might be some donkeys. Let's go! He, good boy! That's a big bird. That's my guy. Come on! That's a big dog and a big bird for a big situation. Sit back. Should we play the game, Bob? Yeah. We play the yeah, game? it's definitely yeah, not banned. No ban. No ban. Bummer. It's all right. We got one more to look at. One more to look at. Come on. Close your eyes. Don't be trying to see his legs now. No. Don't do it. No, no band on him. Here. <laughs> Sit. Drop. Drop. That's it. No, no band. Honk, daddies. No calling. <laughs> I thought they were going to come back hard and do it. Well, next day, uh, the hunt went pretty much exactly how I figured it would. With it being that cold, that was our first big uh, cold day coming off a warm trend. Whenever we have these huge fluctuations, like warm, warm, warm for like a week and then it goes burp. And with clouds like this, all of a sudden the geese change and all their patterns change, their schedules change. So, you know I always like to come here and give my two cents for the day. We did our best, um, we did our best. Honestly, I, I just could, I don't think, there were some shot calls on the left side. Uh, if I hadn't have been on the left side and maybe on the right, the clients could have shot a lot more on the left, but neither here or there, what do you do? Big news, Killer Kurt. Y'all know Killer Kurt. Uh, he's the one that does all of our taxidermy inside the lodge here. Check it out. Where are we gonna put them? Um, I don't know, where do you wanna, where, where do you think we ought to put them? It turned out awesome, hold them up. Show everybody at home. Okay. This is my Brant from Alaska. Dude. So you got it. Yeah. I've never seen one. Oh, you haven't? No, they're all backed up. Mm-hmm. What a beauty. Oh, got dude, we got log? Patrick the starfish, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got Patrick. <laughs> Patrick got caught in this one. That looks awesome. Look at him. Good job, Kurt. Oh, dude, Kurt that looks awesome, nice. man. What a beauty. Man. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. Thank you, thank you. Where should we put him? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. He's got to be down here, right? Yeah, he has to be seen. Yeah, he's got to be. All right, what let's about, do some snooping. What about? Right, hang him on the elk. Yeah, <laughs> hang him on the elk. <laughs> well, that spot. I think that's the right call. And it'll be down here so people can see him. Mm -hmm. And it kind of, look how kind of the wing kind of goes over the light. Mm -hmm. That's Which neat. Is that? That's cool. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, isn't that neat? Can't really see him on here very well. That's He's so dark. dark. It is a black bird, dude. Black. Just a black, they are black. That's a weird crow. <laughs> <laughs> Come on now, this is not OSHA recommended. No. Well, we found the spot. Kurt got both of, all of them done. 
Got the dead mount done. Check that out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Put them right next to each other on each side of the light. That's going to be the move. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh yeah, that's gonna be perfect. Dude, that's beautiful. How, how wouldn't you like that? Be like 30 of them. The bobcat might need to go. Where do you wanna put the bobcat? I don't know, that's just I'm not. I'm good with moving the bobcat, I just didn't know where to put it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, now having the birds like lined up looks really good. You know what? Dude, that's sweet. I like it. A lot. Kurt killed it, he always does. Big shout out to Kurt. Uh, he does all of our tax for the lodge. He helps us hunt. He helps us clean birds. He helps us set decoys. Helps us scout. Thank you, Kurt. We love you so much. Oh man, feels good to capture the moment from Alaska. You know, shooting those brant. Those were the two best brant that I had shot on that trip, and to have them uh, mounted and, and in the lodge for everybody to see. I wanted them somewhere where everybody could see them. Sure enough, uh, we found a spot. I gotta get off here, I have to get situated. We have clients rolling in and literally, what time is it? Yeah, 30 minutes, 30 minutes. There'll be 10 new clients coming in. If you guys have thought about booking a hunt, here we had uh, a COVID opening, unfortunately, for the 29th, December 29th through January 2nd. Hit me up on Sand Hill Flyways. You know, that's the best way to do it. Or you can uh, fill out an inquiry form to book on sandhillflyways.com. So thank you all for being here, but until next time.